One thing I'm gonna live by is that I will never stick to one aesthetic. I got some of this. Uh-huh, some of that. Damn, some of that. Uh-huh, you know she cleans up nice. Okay, this first one I got nominated to Homecoming Court my freshman year of high school. Um, I got this at Ross for $20. I remember being embarrassed that it was from Ross, but it's honestly so beautiful. Also, I got nominated to Homecoming Court as somewhat of a joke, but I still did it in Slade. I think this is beautiful. Okay, this one is from the actual Homecoming Dance my freshman year. It's so cute! I remember being so, so excited about it. I love that it was light pink. So beautiful. Okay, this is my sophomore year homecoming dress. Literally thought I was two sizes bigger than I was in high school. So I wore this belt with it. Literally did not know what size I was, I swear, until last year. Um, but yeah, I think this is really cute. It's definitely like, we went for a more casual look, me and all my friends, I think, because it was super uncool to go to homecoming after your freshman year, I don't know why. So this is my last homecoming dress. Give this to Kevin. 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 Here you go, Kevin. red one piece from Avid Love. What I really like about it is that it does have the things for stockings. I love this. So I got these at the same time at Victoria's Secret, but they weren't supposed to be in a set. I kind of like did a DIY set, but I love how this thong has cutouts and it doesn't look that comfortable, but it actually is. Like I would, I don't just wear this like to take pictures and like I wear this as like regular underwear. This piece is actually from Zaffall and um, honestly, I did not think it was going to be like that comfortable when I first got it, but oh my god you guys like this i i wouldn't sleep in this but this is really comfortable monday we start off tame tuesday we keep it classy wednesday we let loose a little thursday we start to get restless friday it's time to get nasty saturday we let it all hang out First we have these platform stripper heels. They are by NYLA. They are beaten to hell. She wore these every day, basically. She would crawl on stage in them. They're not holding up too well, but I still think they're gorgeous. Then we have this gorgeous long sleeve extreme crop top made out of lace and velvet from Fredericks of Hollywood. Ignore that my bra doesn't really work under it. Then we have this gorgeous mesh dress I think the brand said next up, never heard of them, but I love it. I still have my shorts on under this, so ignore that it's a little bulky. Another Fredericks of Hollywood top. 
This is a halter with a little keyhole and it's Velcro on the neck. Then we have this little crushed velvet halter moment. Um, the brand said ALJO. Don't know what that is. Um, also has a Velcro neck. Okay, this is like the army green one. I love it. It's so soft. All right, then we've got the same version, just white. And this one is a bit see-through, which is a little disappointing, but it's okay. And then finally, this is the black version. I will say these are very, very stretchy. Okay, now we've got like the crew neck ones. So I got a red one and I got a white one. In what world would she think that I would not want this dress? This dress is perfect. like this i'm starting to figure it out i feel like a spider i think you can wrap this however you'd like so let's see how this goes i'm sorry i love it you can also tie it in a bunch of different ways Crop top is a Lululemon dupe and it is so cute. So technically this top is a workout top so I paired it with some bike shorts, but how cute is it with this wrap skirt? I love it. Here are my five must-have bras from Amazon. Number one is this lace-up push-up bra. When I worked at Victoria's Secret, I had girls come in every single day and ask me, what bra is going to hold up my girls together and push them up? For the price and the result of this bra, I think every girl needs to have one of these in their wardrobe. The padding is in the shape of a hand, which I feel like helps lift and scoop and bring the girls together. Here's a before and after. Number two is the Ultimate Comfy Bralette by Hanes. I love this one. It's so good. It makes me feel like I'm not wearing a bra at all, but if you have a larger chest and you want thicker straps, I recommend this one by Warners. I tie-dyed mine, and I love the way it looks. Number four is this multi-way strapless convertible bra. It has a fairly inclusive shade range, and because the cup is full coverage, it literally does not fall down. And lastly, it's this sports bra tank top. I am so impressed with the quality, the fit, and the support of this sports bra. I highly recommend this style, especially for my larger chested ladies. If you like the sports bra look and want the support, thanks for watching. <laughs>